The peppermint. Hey y'all. Yeah. Today is Monday. And we are about to go to the farmer's market. So at the farmer's market, I like to get all of my meat fresh. fresh. Um, we like to get fruit, seasonings. What else do we get from the farmer's market? Uh, fruit, seasoning, hold on. Let me get out the list. What's the deal? Why are you crying? Mace is crying because he want to go. And he not going. It's too cold. I said meat. Oh, so you said fruit and meat? Yeah. And seasoning. Yeah, I said that. Yeah. <laughs> so, we get fresh fruit, fresh meat. So, chicken, ground turkey, all kind of chicken. Like, party wings, legs, breasts, all of that. And seasoning. And that's it. How much you think we're going to spend? Seventy. Yeah. I think fifty. Maybe. I think fifty. So, yeah, I'm ready. This is the process we're doing. We'll be tripping, tripping. So we just got back from the farmers market. I wanted to film inside, but they have a no photography or videography policy. So yeah. I'm about to go ahead and unload our groceries and I'm going to show y'all what we got. So since I've been shopping and stuff, I always wash my hands whenever I walk in the kitchen. Even if it's just to take some stuff out the bag. I'm a super germaphobe. So I can't stand like dirty hands or feeling dirty or touching public spaces, using public restrooms. I don't like stuff like that.
making dinner. These are the little pans I was talking about. <laughs> you want no brownies in these? <laughs> making dinner, we are having lasagna. I don't like these noodles. I like barilla pasta, but this is all that they had. Don't look at my nails. I need them done. I use basil. I use oregano. I use granulated California garlic, garlic powder, paprika, onion powder, black pepper, seasoning salt, regular salt, thyme, and ground turkey for my lasagna. This should last for like a couple of days. in the morning I am actually on my way to the Christmas luncheon for my company um, I'm on a committee that's basically hosting the holiday luncheon which starts at 1130 but we're supposed to be there this is ridiculous we're supposed to be there at 10 45 um, so yeah that's the deal with that and I'm excited I think my hair and makeup came out cute I was having a little trouble with my hair but I got it together I'm actually wearing an outfit from 9 to 5 which is my boutique that launches in February I just I'm just I'm just about to get my life Let's see all right parking will be validated so let me put my parking ticket here I have y'all know I have two phones work phone which I have a distinct Kate Spade case for so I can tell the difference and it's small and then my phone which I have a custom case 
that says my name. Um, a lot of people ask questions about this case. This case is from Etsy. It was sent to me and I like it. Literally, this is the second one I have. Every time I get a new phone, I get the same case. Uh, I just like it. It's plain, simple, black, but it's personalized. All right, so I got both of my phones. Put on my coat because it's cold in Atlanta. We are donating socks and gloves and hats for like a little winter warm-up drive and the plaque. So yeah, I'm about to go to this holiday party. Of course, I work in human resources, so I can't necessarily record our employees because they might not want to be on camera, but I will check in with you guys when I come back and let you know how it went. Okay, y'all, so I'm actually in the restaurant now. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of Fogo de Show, Texas de Brazil, Chamagusha is how you say it. Um, but it's basically a, a Brazilian steakhouse where they walk around, I'm super blue, walk around and serve the meats to you and it's like an extensive salad bar, those kind of things. This is the private room that we'll be in. Um, we should have 76 people. So we'll close the doors and the curtains and kind of just do it like that. But what happens is you basically have these little cards and if it's on red, that means you don't want the server to come to you. If it's on green, that means yes, please bring the meat. So we have some people who only RSVP for salad. I'm gonna go around and collect all the cards and I'll hand the cards back out as people arrive. Hey y'all. So, I tried a new nail shop. Today is Friday. I got my nails done on Tuesday. Last night, the whole polish came off. So I'm about to go get that nail repainted and I'm not going back there again. I'm going back to my old place. I don't care how much it costs. I'll just have to figure it out. And we're also going to pick up my sister from school. Her school's like 45 minutes from my house. Gotta get her at 3.20 I think and it's 1.40. So I need to be on my way around 2.30. So an hour should be enough time. And I need to stop at Best Buy too, so. We're gonna let Mace go. You wanna go? Sit down. You ready to go? You ready to go? Come on, we gotta put your, put your leash on. Come here. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, come on. Whoa. Wait. <sighs> Ready? Yes. <laughs> You're not gonna say hey to the vlog? You just gonna smile like hey. that? You didn't say hey, nothing. Okay. No, too late now. Okay. You gonna drive? Yes, I'll drive. Let's ride. So, just left the nail shop. Got my nail fixed. I'm never going back to that place again. If you live in Tucker, Atlanta, don't go to Queens Nails because they're not good. These nail shops are trash. I had to tell her step by step how to do my nails and then 48 hours, the polish came off. I don't have time to be going to the nail shop every day, okay? So, don't go there. <laughs> Either way. You can't do that. Yes, I can. This is my opinion. My opinion. Macy's excited that he's out the house. 